Hi, I'm Sherry Ann Richardson, and I want to welcome you to another episode of Experimental Homesteader. I'm standing here in my Indiana garden inside my cold frame. This is November 2nd of 2012, and I want to show you some of the plants that are still alive here. Um, we have some pepper plants here. As you can see, there are still peppers. These have no damage. There are still peppers forming. And here, this is the bottom of my cold frame. You can see it's not even really tacked down very good. Um, these are some various perennial plants. Uh, Bubba's checking those out um, that I put in here for safekeeping through the winter. These are peanuts that are dying back, and it'll be about time to harvest these pretty soon. This is a second year tomato plant. Um, Bubba's checking it out right now. Um, I actually grew it from seed the spring of 2011. I grew it in a five gallon uh, bucket. I brought it inside last winter. I brought it outside in March of this year. I set it in an area that was slightly protected. Um, it didn't want to die. So I decided to bring it here to the cold frame and see what would happen. It has started growing and has produced some tomatoes and continues to. As you can see, those are red tomatoes. Um, we have a detour outside. Uh, State Road 18 is actually detouring past our house, so we have a lot more traffic than normal. On this side, I have some lettuce plants, some onion plants, and some pepper plants. And the pepper plants, as you can see, continue to produce. Um, we have had some nights down into the 30s. We have had frost. But this little cold frame um, that we got actually does a really good job. And most of these plants will survive throughout the winter months.